RGTV. 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 Courtney, the tattoo artist. Hey, what's up, y'all? I'm Jason. This is Beats and Tats. Beats and Tats, it's a creative art space. It's a place you might come to get some tattoos done. It's also a place you can come to work on music, as well as just be creative in general. For me, it's the start of my tattoo career, my first time in a shop. So this is, my name's right on Beats and Tats with it. And I'm always gonna look back at this place, you know, no matter where the future brings me, you know, and, and consider this the beginning for me. And it's been good so far. So the, the shop started out uh, at the very first as a studio. We, we have been working on music uh, since we were kids. And then uh, the idea came along to, to mesh the two together, the tattoo world as well as the music industry. Um, and the, they both work pretty good hand in hand. And so, a lot of our clients go hand in hand. Like a lot of people who are into music love getting tattoos. A lot of people who are into tattoos get music. And nowadays that category of people are just spreading in both. So a lot of people are into both. Man. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I would say I would say it's the exact opposite of that. It's like. Um, you know, we, we get people who, who generally may not have uh, known they wanted a tattoo from Courtney until they meet Courtney and see that um, by coming into the studio, uh, as well as vice versa. So it actually it actually works really great together because uh, someone in general who, just like she was saying earlier, who is involved in art and, and creativeness, like they probably are already interested in that as well. So it's almost like a complimentary Exactly. Even a lot of my tattoos have been like music notes or, you know, music themed tattoos because a lot of people are into that. And then a lot of people into music, whether it's just singing or even mixing or whatnot themselves, like they don't find the right studio. So then they come here and be like, oh, your studio too, you know, and it's just a perfect place. Right. So right now, uh, we just have a few online things. Of course, we're on social media. Uh, if, if you don't already follow us on any social media, Twitter, Facebook, uh, Snapchat, um, what did I miss? <laughs> but, but anyway, just follow us, right? Just follow, uh, but um, yeah, we're, so other than that, we haven't, we're, we're actually getting, looking into doing some advertising campaigns, getting yeah. those started. We used to have a group on that went okay, you know, brought in a few clients. Most of it seems like it's word of mouth though, especially for this type of business. I do a tattoo on someone and then everyone sees it, they want a tattoo, you know, their friend wants a tattoo or they come back for another tattoo, so. I, I think what's special about it is, is we spent all this time, these two years, really perfecting our quality and working on our craft and working on what we need to do and now we're at the point we're ready for the, we're ready for the value I know that I can say within a few years we we will unveil an, a newer upgraded location um, that's something we're definitely uh, excited about every single day uh, and just growing as well uh, I, me personally uh, I'd like to see Courtney be one of the top tattoo artists in the in the Midwest period um, and and I think we definitely gonna see that uh, and as well as in the studio, uh, KPR engineer is crazy talented. Um, really I, I'd like to see him uh, really expand his his uh, market on who who he works with. Basically, same thing he said. We're gonna get a new shop eventually, and with that, it's gonna be even bigger. Maybe you'll even see even more artists, um, and just having you know more space. Um, we have already like grown so much in the time I've even been here. So like everything we do, it's like we're looking out for the client's interests and want everyone to feel comfortable and enjoy the atmosphere. And so in that, in the skill alone, just getting better, tattoos getting even better, you know, I wanna spend a little more time like designing some things. It seems like a lot of people just come and have what they want or I'm, working on you know designing what a client wants already instead of just finding the time to just do my own thing you know and then have people come get those but that you're gonna see a lot more in this next year some just original designs uh 
that I'm gonna post and hopefully people come and get because they'd be great portfolio pieces. Um, and we always do specials. So we're gonna keep on with the specials. I post monthly specials on Facebook and those are gonna keep coming, not stop. <laughs> Pizza. All day. USA. Uh, import. <laughs> Apple. Apple. All day. iPhone. <laughs> Team iPhone. Mm, that's tough. Let's go TV for the entertainment. I, I say TV. I do a lot more TV and I probably enjoy it more, but I do love to read and I like a good book too. But I'd lean towards TV. I'd prefer to bike. I'm lazy <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> All right. Sweet. I like cool. cool.